What lessons have I learned from? I don't know. So, what lessons have I learned from my experiences? Um, as far as like my past relationships. Hmm. I guess one part, one part, like as far as I go, definitely for sure, it's probably patience. Like I'm, I'm pretty patient as it is, but you can never have too much patience. So that's one thing. And then maybe also understanding that it's like just because like I haven't been in that many relationships doesn't mean like doesn't mean I shouldn't consider in the fact that like the person's probably been in more relationships than me that like me saying certain stuff a certain way might end up like making her think like a certain way. Because one thing, like, one thing about one of my relationships was, like, it's like she was used to being, like, treated, like, a certain way. Like, in the worst ways. So, it's like, whenever, like, I'd say something that was generally honest or whatever, or that I would, like, take, like, heavy consideration of thinking of, she would just instantly think that it was negative. Like, she thinks stuff was negative. Yeah. And it's like I never really realized that. Until, like, one day she finally just up and told me. But yeah, like, I just, yes, yeah, so that's one thing, definitely. Um, I guess another thing would probably just be, like, more sensitive, that's for sure. Like, you can never have enough of it. Like, it's tough for me, because growing up, like, it's like, I was kind of, like, I was kind of forced not to be sensitive. I was forced, like, kind of just to, like, it's like, to, like, kind of like not have feelings at some points like trying my best to be a robot because it was needed at the time it was needed like is it needed now no it's like i'm and i'm learning that so yeah um trying to think what else um um i don't know because it's like i understand myself as a person if anything, I'd say maybe thinking about it before I jump gun. Like, you know, like before you even start the relationship, like just evaluate yourself as a person. Because I had like, I had one where it's like, I ended up finding out like a few weeks later, like, yeah, I definitely wasn't mature enough. She needed a man. At the time, I was only a boy. So like, yeah. So I distanced myself at the time. Because I honestly didn't, like at the time, really know of the best way of breaking up. Do I know now? Yeah, I'd probably say I'm better with it now. If anything. And then probably understanding what I want. That's another thing. Like definitely understanding that. It's like I, it's like I, I always understood it. But I feel like I understand it better as like I go through relationships. I understand honestly what I mean when I say that I want this and that. And it's like has my mind changed? Not too much, but it has. But not by much. So yeah. I guess being accepted to change and compromise. But it's like I'm it's like it's not that hard to compromise with me though. I'm usually chilled about stuff. I guess another thing would also be like how I evaluate myself as a person because it's like I gotta understand that um that's like yeah I see myself as not like that crazy of a big deal but that's not how she sees me so yeah that's yeah so that's many things like I've learned so yeah so with that love y'all peace